What is up guys? I'm Brad Mew and um, I just wanted to show you guys this new brand new trailer they released for October Omegas and the Mega Latios and Latios that you can fly around on them and shit. Um, I just wanted to tell you guys about this and tell you my shit thoughts. Uh, it looks like shit, actually Steven Soul might actually be giving us the Latios and Latios depending on which game you get this time so we don't have to catch them anymore which is awesome. And then they show Mega Latios and Latios evolved, uh, Mega Evolving. Which isn't really new because we really knew they had those in the game code. It looks like actually Latios is going to have signature move Luster Perch, and why Latios is going to actually have Mist Ball as their signature moves. Mist Ball, I think Luster Perch would probably be a little bit better than Mist Ball, but I'm not going to complain because they both are decent, I guess. It actually shows footage of them flying uh, in the air here, which is completely awesome. I did not expect it to be like this one bit. That looks completely awesome, like you can just actually control them this time. And the Mirage spots, like everyone was speculating. That's basically what it's going to look like right there when you like, encounter Zekrom or uh, Legends up in the air in the sky. You do have to complete, it, they did put out something like, like that you actually like, have to uh, complete like some certain stuff in the game to unlock like each Legend to go catch it and shit. But uh, there actually is some specu speculation going on that Hoopa might be in the game, but it's not confirmed yet, so I'm not even going to believe it. Uh, I, it could be possible, but I doubt it. And here's like all the legends you can actually uh, encounter inside the game, which would be awesome. You can get like all the le all the legends from past gens. Never thought it would be like that. It's completely awesome. Still don't know really know how that's gonna work up in the sky. If you're like after what you have to complete and shit to like get all those legends and stuff like that but uh, it's probably gonna it better not be like insane shit <laughs> to like get them, get them unlocked or shit like that now they're gonna show the Fokinavi which is actually basically like something you can encounter and it shows like base, like new stuff you can use like it with like the map and shit and the counter thing or, like you can use on routes and it is official now the P player search system is now confirmed in ORAS along with Wonder Trade Wednesday, Battle Spot, and all that sh shit from X and Y. So Wonder Trade Wednesday's gonna, or Wonder Trade's gonna be coming back. Which is awesome. Along with Pokemon and me and Super Training, which shouldn't be left out anyways. Because those are awesome. Even though I don't use it too much. And right now is actually, they're gonna actually show the Mega Pidgeot and Mega Beedrill. They look completely insane, even better than the pictures. Mega Pidgeot actually looks like, kinda like, more like a swallow, the way it flies. And uh, it actually looks, like way awesome than I, I would have thought. Along with Mega Beedrill, it looks way awesome. They do show a Galate and a Shiftry. The Shiftry does not have a Mega Evolution. Why Galate does? So that does that mean we're gonna have Mega Shiftry? Do not know, but we might actually might. They show the Pidgeot actually going for a Hurricane there, and a Beedrill going for a Fell Stinger. Um, so if you like this video, feel free to drop a like on this video. Really appreciate it. Subscribe to my channel for more ORAS updates, Pokemon content, and Wi-Fi battles, etc. If you like that shit, subscribe. I do upload daily. And I am actually just so hyped about these games and shit, so I'm out. Brand new.